One morning, the Logar family, who live in south of Slovenia, woke up to find a little furry intruder sleeping beside their pet dog. Not wanting to disturb the bear, thinking that the mother was close by, they left the little cub alone. But the mum never came, and the family was forced to approach the cub. The bear was very thin, and for the first few days they were not sure if he would survive. They named the bear Mido, and with the loving care of the family, he made a full recovery. Although he was adorable, biologists insisted that he couldn't roam freely around the village. But Mr. Logar had a plan. We have a plan. We started making a fence for him. The law requires 100 square meters, but we plan to give him 900 square meters in the forest at the top of the hill. We want to see him get an appropriate space, not a little cage. But the family were caught up in one of the biggest animal custody battles in the country's history, as animal control officers wanted to send Mido back into the wild. Mido got a lot of publicity and was soon given another name, Lucky. The Logars eventually agreed in a compromise that would place the little cub in a shelter for rescued bears. Not long after though, Mido was stolen. That's right folks, someone stole a baby bear. Don't worry though, they eventually found him and Mido was sent to live in the bear sanctuary after all, so he could live with other adopted bears. What do you think? Should Mido have been sent back into the wild, the sanctuary, or stayed with the Logar family? Let us know in the comments. And don't forget to subscribe and watch our other video on the rescue dog that made it into Crufts.